Hi, my name's Elaine Real, and I'm running for trustee of Forbes Library. I want to tell you a little bit about my experience and background, but before I do that, I want to urge all of you to honor Forbes and the great work and great job it does for the community by going out and voting on November 3rd. I know it's not a very, there's not a lot of contested races on the ballot, um, but five good people are running for three slots on this Board of Trustees. My background uh, of service to the, to the city is, is uh, fairly simple. I've, I've been a lawyer for 36 years. I've recently retired. And I served as city solicitor. I'm on the license commission. I was labor counsel to Forbes for 15 years. And I, I know what I think would be effective advocacy on behalf of the library. So I'd ask you to con consider me carefully to honor me with your vote. And I'd like to talk to you a little bit about what I heard as I was out in the community going to farmers markets and asking people to sign my nomination papers. I would ask people uh, to sign them. And the first thing, the first response, wonderful response, almost everyone said, I love Forbes. I use Forbes. Forbes is a great institution. And almost no one realized that the trustees who hire the director of Forbes Library and who manage and establish policy for Forbes Library, that they're elected officials, elected by the whole community. And because Forbes has suffered uh, greatly during the last, well, we've, we've had a lot of fiscal challenges in Northampton during the last decade and a half, you know, Saturday hours have been cut, evening hours have been cut. The outreach program, which serves homebound um, elders and disabled and goes into nursing homes, almost had to be eliminated this year, if not for some private donors who came forward and generously funded it. So I'd like to, to work to get more of Forbes for the community. I, I recognize we have financial constraints, but I think the community needs to support Forbes because Forbes serves in so many ways this community. Thank you for considering me for this position.